Uh, Joe, what was the feeling like before the game, and then can you take us through it a little bit? I mean, that was a, just a wild setup and a wild performance. Yeah, I was uh, excited to be back, that's for sure. Um, first lap warm-ups, you know, felt a little shot of adrenaline right there. I was excited. Um, starting the game was, you know, just as much fun. <laughs> and then, you know, we, we battled all night. It was a good game. We were right there. Um, Obviously, a tough loss. You want to get those. Joe, how much do you feel the energy of the crowd, or you know, kind of every time you were shown on the screen or your name or whatever? How much do you how much do you feel that in the game? Yeah, it's you definitely feel it. The momentum. That's the great thing about home ice, um, especially in playoffs. You, you definitely feed off it, build off it. You want more. Um, just trying to stay in the moment, really. Uh, Max, uh, um, Jake just said. The expectation was that you guys were going to get the next goal. It just felt that way. It seemed like it felt that way in the first overtime, too. It seems like these overtimes you've played very well, so do you just take anything good out of that? Uh, yeah, I thought we did a good job of clawing back into that game. Um, obviously, Joey dragged everyone to the plate with him, um, so it's a lot of good to, to build on from that, but uh, no, it would have been nice, like you said, to get the two points, but uh, that's why it's a seven-game series, right? So we'll clean up some things and be ready to go for game two. The way you guys did start this game a little bit slow, the four goals pretty quickly there from, from Seattle. Is there any thought that comes into your mind about four days off where you guys maybe did, did it just take a minute for you to snap it back into the realities of playoff hockey and, and be ready to play? Max, for you, I guess. Um, no, I mean, not at all. Obviously, rest is a weapon at this time of year. So I um, thought we had a really good practice the other day and good morning skate. Boys are ready to go. So, um, I mean, hey, just a couple mistakes. Um, here or there, and that's playoff hockey, right? It's, uh, it's playing chess out there, and um, we'll learn from it, and we'll be better next game for sure. Max, yesterday you kind of mentioned that it was kind of surreal to play with Joe. Just what did you learn um, on playing on a line with him about him today? Um, yeah, no, obviously a guy that uh, I think we've all looked up to at some point in our career for a long time, played against Joe for a long time, and we all know what he brings to the table and how special he is and how I mean, important he is to our group. Um, so, no, obviously when you get a chance to play with him, you got to make the most of it and um, make all those little small plays. He likes to hang on the puck. He goes to the dirty areas. So um, just get him the puck in, in those areas, and he seems to capitalize every single time. So it's a great night by him tonight, and uh, we got to build on it. Uh, Max, you said you felt like you had to clean a couple things up. What specifically do you feel like as a team you got to clean up to win a game two? Uh, we we keep most of that stuff in house, to be honest with you. Um, I mean, that's just how it is at this time of year. We'll we'll address those things and, and watch some video. And obviously, I mean, hey, we weren't too far off. Uh, I think we did a lot of good things, and um, just gotta get a little better. But that's, I mean, even if you win, you gotta find ways to get better and take that next step every single day. So um, that's what we'll do. Uh, Joe, we talk about the chess match all the time of meeting an opponent, and playing them for seven games. What is it? What have you learned about Seattle in this one game? I think coming in, you, you, you kind of saw it in the first round. You know, they're they're a good team up and down the lineup. They they play a four-line game. They get a lot of contributions up and down the lineup, um, and, and they can skate. They play fast. I, I think, you know, at times they you play that Minnesota series, they slowed it down at times. Um, and, and this team's, you know, they're looking to attack. You know, they're looking to get the puck up. Battles, you know, when you're, you're in the corner in the D zone, they're they're firing pucks back. You know, to the front of the net, and and they have good support. Um, you know, it's, it's stuff you saw, it's stuff we we're ready for. We talk about a little bit here and there, and yeah, it just comes down to you know a few extra battles. Joe, Pete told us uh, going into Game Six uh, with the Wild that you were pretty close to returning, and just just what were these last couple of days like? Just waiting, anticipating getting back in there. Yeah, I think uh, you know, go on the trip, start skating. Um, you know, feel feeling pretty good. It's it's one of those things. It's tough to sit out when you're you're that close. Um, you know, I think the full intention was to go game seven if needed. You know, so I was trying to get mentally engaged, ready ready for that. The guys did a tremendous job last round. Um, but just yeah, yeah, just getting back into it mentally is a big part of it. And um, we've got a couple extra days rest. And, you know, we're just ready to go. I don't. Joe, um, what was this entire process like for you from game one when it happened to, to this point? I mean, we haven't talked to you for a while. Just, you know, <laughs> what, what was this whole thing like for you? Oh, I had a little experience, um, you know, one other time with it. So you kind of lean on some of those 
feelings and thoughts and just take it slow, you know, listen to the body a little bit. And, um, you know, I think we did a lot of good things along the way and had a lot of good help along the way. And, um, yeah, I, I mean, just rest up early, try to do, you know, take care of the body the right way and those types of things. And it was just really trying to get a little bit better each day and trying to, you know, everyone's asking, you know, how's the head? And <laughs> every time it was, I think it's good. It's getting better. It's getting better. But, you know, you're always looking for something. And oh, I think over the last few days, there's definitely a sense of clarity that, that kind of came back and I felt confident.